Hi, welcome back. Today I'm going to solve this problem, where we have this nasty looking cube root that we need to deal with. So, the first thing I'm going to do is write this out again. And then I'm going to cube all of it. This means I need to cube the right hand side as well. And now you'll see that the cube root and the cube actually cancel. So on the left hand side, this leaves us with just 2 to the power of x minus 4. And this still equals 32 cubed. Now you may recognize 32 as being on our 2 power table where 2 to the power of 1 equals 2, 2 to the power of 2 equals 4, 2 to the power of 3 equals 8, 2 to the power of 4 equals 16, and 2 to the power of 5 equals 32. So 32 can be rewritten as 2 to the power of 5. So let's do that. So we have 2 to the x minus 4 equals 2 to the power of 5 or to the power of 3. Now how do we resolve this situation where we've got a number raised to a power and it's all raised to another power? Well, there's a rule that says if we have a number raised to a power, and that's all raised to another power, then we can rewrite that as that same number raised to the powers multiplied together. So that means we can rewrite this as 2 to the power of x minus 4 equals 2 to the power of 5 multiplied by 3. And because both sides of the equation now have the same base, that means that the powers must be equal. So x minus 4 must equal 15. And if we add 4 to both sides, we get that x equals 19. And that's our answer. OK, let's do a quick check. So we have the cube root of 2 to the power of 19 less 4. So that's 15. And that should equal 32. Now another way of writing cube root is to raise the number to the power of 1 third. So this becomes 2 to the power of 15 all raised to the power of one third. And again, in accordance with this rule, we can rewrite this as two to the power of 15 multiplied by one third, which equals two to the power of five. And if we check over here, we see that two to the power of five does indeed equal 32. So this equals 32 as expected. Hope that was useful to you. See you in the next video.